Hey guys, what is up? It is your boy Michael here with Playthroughs Rio, bringing you another episode of Temtem, our Pokemon like MMORPG adventure. And today, we're going to be focused on trying to complete the rest of these side quests that we actually have access to. So, we're going to travel back to Neodeo and uh, just. I think we have to go over to Omnisia. Could be wrong. I could be wrong. But I think that's one of the places we have to go. Uh, even if I am incorrect, I would like to buy the house. So that is something that I would really like to do here. Let's just go ahead and check. There's a question mark there. Question mark there. So let's go ahead and check those out and see if we can complete any of those. If you guys are new to the channel, first of all, thank you so much. Uh, I truly appreciate you checking out this video in the channel. I do upload every day at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, so if you're looking for daily content, I am 100% your dude. And the correspondent returns. Yes, I've explored some Ponku. And it's extremely modern and hip. Oh, yeah. My readers are going to go crazy for this. You can't imagine how many young tamers dream of going to some Ponku and being part of the scene. Go on. The Ryokan is the oldest inn in the archipelago. I ascended through the pillars high above. Perilous route. Exactly. That's the perfect counterpoint. The cutting edge urban scene of Neodeo and the permescence of the traditional ways in the countryside. What's the highlight that every visitor should experience for themselves? A pilgrimage to the shores of the Sacred Lake. Marvelous. Oh, I'm so jealous of you now. I'm going to take a sabbatical as soon as my bloody leg heals and I'm going to travel all around just for fun. That was great A material playthroughs. Here, have this. I got it as a review sample from a cutting-edge firm that shall remain unnamed. I think you deserve to try before anyone else. I don't do that much Tim Tim Taming anyway. So we got a reactive vial. Once per battle, when attacked with an effect or super effective technique, it nullifies and recovers 15% of health. That's actually pretty good. Please tell me you're heading to Arbory now. Just one more island and my guide will be done. Alright, so that actually isn't out yet. So we can ignore this. And we need to deliver the incubator prototype to Akihiro. I really don't know where that is. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I want to say that is in, like, not Uhuru, but around there. So, I'm not entirely sure. Which is, is it better to go this way? Yeah, it is. All right. Wait. Yes. Okay. Whew. All right, and then I think in the next episode, we're going to be potentially fighting some dojo, some dojo people, or, yep, or even in this episode, to be completely honest with you. I really want to get this house a rolling, you know? Uh, how do you like your, our Taifu? They're lovely. All right, so we need to trade an Ukama here. We don't have that yet. Do we have enough money? Can we just can we go to our bag and look? We do not. If we go to the Temporium, we should be able to sell some stuff. Sell? Don't want to do that. Single use. Oh gosh. I want to sell any of this breeding stuff. Um, huge crystal. All right. Silicone chunk can be sold at a good price. Okay. To so continue for information for the breeding center incubator to a fast hatch. All right. I really don't want to waste all of my money. <laughs> to be completely honest right here we're going to continue on um this episode i'm going to try and really focus on unlocking a lot of the waypoints as i find them i'm sure there's going to be some down here and then i'm also going to do the daily package just see if there's anything down here there is that's the house so we don't really need to come down here and then we'll go to Ulterior Omnesia. Haven't been down here in a really, really long time. But there's this huge skate path. 
and I'm not entirely sure, but I think there are some items that we can actually snag from here, so I'm going to look. It's been such a long time. Just want to make sure. We're going to be exploring a lot of stuff, and, you know, it's been so long since I've been to a lot of places. I'm not entirely sure what uh, we have left potentially to explore. So we're just going to come back down here. Alright, so here's a nice little area. New matter transport registered. Oh. We did go over there already. But it looks like there's some crevices over here that we can potentially get some items in. We can. Alright, cool. Enhancer watermelon and average crystal. More items that we can sell, which is nice. And then we're pretty much done here. Um, Tukma. No. Kisawa. Alright, so let's go back over here. Go back to Kisawa, because I'm pretty sure that's where we need to return the egg incubator. We've been to Amnesia, wasn't here. It's obviously not here. And I really think it's over here in Kisawa. Might be in Denny's, who knows, but I really don't. I think it's back. Way, way back. So we're going to check. We can also snag our daily mail quest today. So that's what we're going to do. I'm really excited to get into raids. And depending on how many of the quests we get for our daily here is really dependent on if we're going to be able to get to any of the dojos today. Yes. All right, we got one package. Uh, okay. Fu, uh, Fumu Fan and Turquesa. All right, that's fine. And it's marked right there. Okay. We have to start getting a lot of Thames together for the cultists. And I think the best way to do that is going to try and force brute our way through some of the dojo trainers so that way we can train some of the Thames that we're going to be using for the cultists. I'm not entirely sure how powerful the cultists are going to be. I could be completely wrong. Maybe it's better to do it the other way. I guess I'll have to look. Because I have some strong Thames of every type, I believe. So I guess we could always try and figure that out at some point. And I have a lot of Wishy Well coins. But I'm not entirely sure how many I have. I think it's close to 20. If not 20. Might be more, actually. And the Chini Grotto. Alright. Okay, don't need Skunch. Don't need that. Let's go ahead and run. Unfortunately for us, Malflank is a normal Tem and not a hybrid, so we can't really use him in anything. Because I don't think there's normal Tems for cultists. I think the first one we actually might try and take on is the water, just because we have Nesla. And we can get a Babawa. And then that should pretty much be able to take down everything. So, we'll check that out. I'm so thankful for this teleportation stuff. Like, you guys have no idea. Am I correct? Is it over here? Oh, it's all the way over here. Yeah, that is pretty far. There really, unfortunately, is no other way to get back there. Oh, that's a lot of traveling. I could be wrong. This might not even be it. But I think that it is. I really think that it is. Alright. Go ahead. Nope. I don't want to talk to Kinu. I would like to activate this waypoint here. Alright. Cool. Up we go. Wait, I have the skates. I can actually explore this while we're over here. 
I'm totally gonna do that. 100%! Gonna do that. I feel like some of the music has changed. Could be wrong, though. Yes. Thank you. Alright, so... Uh, okay. This fixates on the HP. Average crystal... Sharpening. Okay. Technique bestows attack and speed increase by one level for each. Okay. Alright. Well, that's cool. We will continue our way all the way over here. And if I am completely wrong, well then you know what? It's kind of okay because we can... Gosh, I don't remember it being, like, that far away. We can always teleport. It's not really a big deal. And we're going around unlocking the teleports as well, so... I mean, that's always good. I'm sure there's not something over here. Nope. There's probably one, like, inside here, or... Right outside. That's my assumption. Yep, there it is. Alright. Figured there would be because it's a mini game or daily. Don't really know. All right, down we go. So how much of this can we actually skip? Not much, to be completely honest with you. Man, it's been forever. I thought it was gonna be over here. Like, in this area. <sighs> Vambai, yes. This is where I remember sending the eggs to. It was, like, right over here. I don't know why the question mark is over here now. That's what I was looking for. No. Alright. Okay. Alright, well, I guess we'll find out what is actually here. I'm not entirely sure. Super sense. Um. Oh my goodness. I don't really think it matters which way we go. So, we'll just go this way. I'm looking at the map, it doesn't matter. Is this a person here that battles us? Oh, we actually haven't been up here? Interesting. So glad the war's over. We spent it catching Tams all day so the grown-ups could fight the Balsoto. We need more Tem Tam, Bahati. Go fetch us some. No, you can't fight with us, little girl. <laughs> You're too young. Show me then. Yeah, let's do this. Wasn't sure we'd actually battle anyone. Oh, that's a... <laughs> that's a Tem. <laughs> that is a Tem. Oh, gosh. Alright, we'll just use Goring on Volfi here. Oh, we one-hit it. Woo, baby. Yeah, I figured that would be super effective. It looked like it would be. 75 experience. Yikes. That's not a lot. Alright. Let's we'll use Sharp Leaf here and Double Kick here. Finish this off. Asukin! Madrid. Yep. Stone Ball. It's probably not going to do much to Malphank. We might just heal all of it back up. Almost all of it. There we go. Alright. Crystal Earth, Tim. So what do you think? I'm not bad, eh? Don't I deserve another chance? Yeah, I guess. Could have been could have been worse. Oh, I physically I can't go through there. Alright. Oh, not what I wanted. There's also an item down there as well. Oh, we're gonna be fighting more people. Okay. Hello, Tamer. Wanna tempt him up? 
Sure thing. I have to test these new Thames I just captured. See if they're up to scratch. Why did I never come over this way? Hmm. I don't really remember. If this was an area that we had or not. Alright. Beta Burst is going to be super good here. In I mean, Galus does not have a lot of defense, so... I knew that was going to KO. Drill Impact. Half damage, because it's a normal damage. Alright, this will just Shard Leaf and Double Kick and KO. Only these battles don't take too long. It's always a positive. Obviously yours are better, but I think these ones were decent. Just going to take them to the dojo. You definitely do that. Rocket. Okay. Gotti. Alright. Well, we don't need to mess with this. And what is this guy? He's dressed like a Bel Soto. Kissawa and Trader. You with the resistance? Of course, free Kissawa. You're so deluded then. <laughs> You think you're doing something heroic here? You're only serving the corrupt dojo masters and their evil overlords. Kisawa won't be truly free until we get rid of the dojos and their masters. Clan Bell Soto is our only chance for a new lord. You're crazy. How's this guy here? Alright, no, you're evil. <laughs> I'll make an example of you, dojo puppet. Yeah, what is, how's this guy just still chilling out here? Bell Soto's been slapped across the other half of the world. Sharp Leaf and Goring. Sharp Leaf should KO this. Yep. Pocus, though, is probably going to do some damage to Malphite. Kind of expected that. Yep. Sparzy. Double Kick. Man, this thing. So weak. Gamma Burst! <sighs> Looks like a powerful move. Oh, Pocus is definitely going to get KO'd. We're going to heal that back up. Sharp Belief and Goring. And we're good to go. <laughs> Can't believe this... Bell Soto guys just here. They just left him behind. They just did not care. They did not care. Alright. <laughs> Claim Bell Soto will save us all. <laughs> That's just not going to happen, my dude. It's just not going to happen. Oh, yes. It's another trainer? Oh, yeah, it is. No, I never joined the resistance. Okay, I just want to tempt him up. Sounds good. I don't care what you do, my dude. We already won. We won for now. We still have to go take out Telebos in the last expansion, but it's not really an issue. Goring? Oh, wow. We almost one-hit Pig Epic. And I know that thing has a lot of HP. Alright, Sharp Leaf and Double Kick. It probably actually had one HP left, which is pretty wild to think about. Aquatic Whirlwind. Poor Ukama. He's about to get wrecked. He tried. Malflank's over here just chilling. Like saving the archipelago or something. Go be a hero and leave me alone. We already did, bro. Let me get my items. Card Super Sent. All right, I feel like we should have come over here a really long time ago. All right, so it looks like we actually need to jump across here. Not really a big deal. Oops. 
Oh. Okay. And then we'll see what's over here, because I honestly have no idea, to be completely honest. Well, I came over here before. What is this? Oh, okay. She's doing fine on her own. She's our, she, here's the prototype already tested. Capital. Careful now. Hand it over. Don't drop it. I think such a delicate technological wonder has to travel in the hands of such rough messengers. Oh, here's a cutscene. Senior businesswoman. <laughs> Excuse me, professor. Yes. Give me that. Nobody gets hurt. <laughs> uh, what? None of your business. You stay away from this tamer if you know what's good for you. You heard it. Stop making a fuss and hand me the machine quietly. Don't touch me. Knock it off, old man. By hook or by crook, Grim Belsoto has his trinket. A Belsoto agent. Businesswoman with a client. They have pants on and they get that thingy delivered. Well, I always deliver. This wasn't in the briefing, but you're leaving me no choice. All right, so we're going to battle. Valish and Saipat. I have a feeling that we're pretty overleveled here. And this poor woman's about to get absolutely wrecked. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't say poor woman. Because, you know, Bel Soto and whatnot. Venomous Claws on Kinu? Nope, on Mouthlike. Alright, well, we healed more than what we got damaged. That's always good. Dendry. Sharp Leaf and Double Kick. Should do over half. Woohoo! Almost the fat KO. Dendry's not going to do much to either of our Thames here. Yep. Kazuma. Beta Burst and Goring. We should take out both of these, to be completely honest. Oh, yeah. Poor Kazuma has, like, no defense, man. Alright, I'm going to turn my webcam off. Because I feel like we're going to have a moment up here that we can use for uh, a thumbnail. This is bad business. <laughs> yeah, it is bad business. I have no insurance against this. Forget it. <laughs> wow. I was so scared. Oh, by the pan suns. Any damage? Here's a machine. Ah, yes. Come with Papa, little brave one. This brave tamer has brought you to me and saved you from evil, evil people. Let's see how you're made. Not bad. Not bad. Clever solution to the overheating problem here. Needs a little calibration here. There. And these settings are off a bit. Let me fine tune this and this. Okay, done. This should work. Yes, yes, yes. Everything working as intended. This is going to revolutionize Tam Tam breeding. Another victory for progress. Glad to help out science. Alright, that should be good. As a thanks, you can keep this prototype and you can have another great invention of mine. You're becoming my go-to tester. We got a drill. Alright. When attacking and evading target, removes the evading status condition. The technique will not fail if this damage is done. Oh, damage is increased by 15%. It's too unwieldy for its original purpose, but perhaps you'll find an applied use with Temtem or something. Just keep it, okay? And now to refine those blueprints and see how we can make it cheaper for the mass market. Let's see. All right. That's pretty cool. So we've healed up. We got whatever this is now. Where do I shoot out of from here? I honestly don't remember. If we just walk out this door, where we come out of. Okay. Over here in Tukma. All right. Well, oh, well, we can't go there. So we'll just travel back. Set ourselves up for Dennis, and then I will complete my quest. <sighs> all right, guys. Well, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. I truly, truly, truly appreciate it. just want to give a special shout out to my patrons over at Patreon. You guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you all so, so much for your continued support. And for the rest of you, whether it's watching, liking, comment, subscribing, or sharing my content, any way that you all support the channel is truly appreciated. And until next time, I will see all you beautiful people later. Thanks so much for watching.